Well, there we have it, a crazy day here in Hungary at round five, and the top three that finished on the podium, well, they certainly deserved it. Let's have a chat with our podium finishers. Pavel Korbelinski, third step on the podium once again, man, you are on fire. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah, uh, I'm super happy. Back-to-back uh, -back third place, uh, Idris Masters. That that means a, a world to me, to be honest. So I'm, I'm really, I'm really happy, really excited, and uh, yeah, it's a great scenario. The the round was really tough. Uh, the, all the sessions were uh, were really difficult. The, the weather conditions were. Uh, I think that was one of the toughest rounds yes. I've ever been uh, been to. The temperatures were sky high. Uh, it was around 35 degrees in uh, in air, and uh, I think at least double as much in, in our in the car. <laughs> yeah, in the cars. Yeah, but I'm uh, I'm super happy, totally satisfied with the results. Man, you, you look so good. It's just good to see you on form in this car. Look, three weeks. We're in, we're in your hometown. We're in we're in Poland. You're in the stadium. Yeah. You get to do it all over again. It would be the dream to get on the podium once again, right? Oh yes, it would be. Especially uh, that I got third place last year. So yeah, it would be uh, a dream come true to to uh, to match the result or, or better it. So yeah, I'm already looking forward. Uh, and it is a kind of a home round for me. So so yeah. <laughs> Look, man. What do we say? We we, we can't even say. Do more because you are doing as much as you can. You've been consistent all weekend. The judges are loving what you're doing. Congratulations, man. We'll see you in Poland. Thank you very much. And see you in Poland. Torani Kavia, you're back. Yeah. Second step on the podium. That is the first time I've ever said that. Man, you're ripping. It's been a bumpy road this year. You've not found the form. You took some time out last season. Yeah. But man, have you come back with that sledgehammer approach? Oh yeah. No, it's been so good. Like I think it showed from already in Spain. Like we were on it, uh, but we we're missing always the details. Yeah. And I always did like a stupid mistake. And uh, this weekend, my girlfriend said to me, "Well, Tor." If you're gonna win, you need to step it down 10%, <laughs> and you're gonna get on that podium. And it worked. And yeah, I'm just super happy. But man, we head in three weeks' time to events that you love. Stadium yeah. events yeah. are ones that you absolutely adore. It's just time to shine, I guess, to keep the momentum going, keep that 10% in the locker for the final, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Look, Poland last year, you weren't there. How are you looking forward to 56,000 people cheering your name? No, oh, it's crazy. Uh, like. Uh, the atmosphere there is unbelievable. So yeah, really looking forward to it. Hope we can keep up the momentum. Like we've been bleeding out points in the championship since day one. So hopefully we can get into that top 10. And if we do really good, I think still top five is possible, but we'll need to see on the, on the yeah, standing. On the weekend. Well, look, we'll let you chill for the evening. Thank you. We'll see you in Poland, man. Congratulations. Thank you. Laurie Heinen, congratulations, top step on the podium and the only guy this year to get on the top step twice. Man, you must be feeling incredible. Yeah, it's it's like a dream. I, <laughs> I think I, after the Finnish, the Finland win, uh, I think I have not be able to do it again, but here we are. And you, you did it in style. You said it was too easy today on the broadcast. You said it was easy battle after easy battle, but in the final you had to turn it up for Kavir because he was on form. Um, look, sometimes you have to take those easy battles, you know? You've clawed a lot of points ahead now in the championship. Three weeks till Poland. Can it be done? You were so close this time last year. It must look even stronger this time. Yeah, actually, I'm not really comfortable on the like top dog position. <laughs> I'm, I'm more happy to be the underdog. The underdog, yeah. yeah. But today uh, we we did what we have to do and put some safe runs, and I didn't like it. But I I, I had some nerves to go on the final if I can push. Yeah. But it was uh, nice to see that I could. Yeah. Well, look, these stadium arenas, these concrete walls, they aren't going to be forgiven. I don't think there's going to be any safe runs in Poland. So you'll be comfortable there, that's for sure. Yeah. Look, Laurie, congratulations once again, man. Thank you. We'll see you in Poland, and we wish you all the best of luck for this championship. Thank you. And there you have it, a new face on the podium, a back-to-back -back third place, and a man that has finally done it, a two-time top-step finisher. What an incredible day, what an incredible weekend here in Hungary.